There's a lot of people. We're gonna skip that. We're gonna skip that. We're gonna go to Zephaniah. Zephaniah 3 and 8. It's, man, it's a lot of people. Therefore, wait ye upon me, right? Because, you know, vocab has a problem with, uh, with the fact that we say we're waiting on the Lord to get busy on you fucking demons. Right? You got a problem with that vocab? That's cool. But what did these nations do unto us? Do they not deserve the destruction that's coming? Do they not deserve their judgment? Every action has a judgment. Especially for you Edomites. If one of you Edomites lost your sister to some... Uh, nigga, as you would say, some some black nigga. If you lost your sister to him, he raped her. Man, he did her just dirty, spit in her, you know, just just beat her like Emma Till got beat, and then hung her, left her to die, and, and, and cut her from sternum to, 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 to asshole to to, to to sternum, and left her to hang there with her insides hanging out. You would have a problem with that, and you would get your, you would get your revenge, and you would get your your justice, whether it was through the courts or not. And you, that's just the way you are. So why is it not fair for the Most High to get his his vengeance? Because you have done the nation of Israel completely dirty. You have treated the men of Israel uh, and the women of Israel like like less than animals, and therefore you're going to be judged for that. And that's what all these scriptures are getting into. You put us in slavery, we're going to put you in slavery. You killed us with the sword, we're going to kill you with the sword. Through the spirit and power of your high by Shemya Rashad. That's judgment. That ain't hate speech. You, you stupid idiots out there. You just hear a, a catchphrase and want to use it all the time. Oh, hate speech. This is straight out the Bible. Raw and uncut. If you got a problem with that, you got a problem with the most high. You ain't got a problem with this. We don't come out here in our own name And we ain't talking our own words We spitting straight out the scriptures yeah. Therefore wait, wait ye upon me Saith Yahweh until the day That I that I rise up to the prey For my determination Is to gather the nations That I may assemble the kingdoms To pour out upon them Mine indignation even all my fierce anger, for all the earth shall be devoured with the fire of my jealousy. Right? All the earth is going to be uh, devoured. That's why we have to be uh, beamed up in those chariots. Right? And there's going to be land that's not completely destroyed, but there's going to be a time period where we're going to be in the heavens. You know, probably looking at the places that Yahweh Shai um, created for us. He said he went to go prepare a place for us. Watch. And, you know, during that time of this vengeance and this judgment, Lord willing, and the, the cleansing of the land, because Edomites ruined this world and this place. Um, you know, Lord willing, we get beamed up in those chariots and we get to spend time out there with the Al Shah and, and, and inherit our, uh, our planet. You know, that's that's what we look forward to. We look forward to the downfall of the so-called white man. You know, I don't care how they feel about it. Zephaniah 1 and 18. Neither their silver nor their gold shall be able to deliver them in the, in the, in the day of Yahweh's wrath. So even these rich Edomites who got all this paper, all this money... You ain't going to be able to deliver yourself with that, right? It says that you're going to cast your gold into the streets, right? But the whole land shall be devoured by the fire of his jealousy, for he shall make even a speedy riddance of all of them that dwell in the land. And this is talking about uh, the Edomites, right? Because all of Babylon the Great, spiritually Edom, spiritually Egypt, spiritually uh, uh, Sodom and Gomorrah is going to be destroyed, right? It's a people before a place, and that's why this is spiritually Edom, right? And when it talks about Edom being destroyed, it's talking about the nation, not the land. And the, the land being desolate, when it's talking about that, it's actually talking about the people. If you have ears to hear, 
Right, this is Isaiah 66 and 16. Started, starting at 15. For behold, Yahweh will come with fire and with his chariots like a whirlwind to render his anger with fury and his rebuke with flames of fire. For by fire and by his sword will Yahweh plead with all flesh and the slain of Yahweh by Hashem Yahushai shall be many. Does that sound like we're terrorists? If we're terrorists, we're terrorists for the Lord. Because he is a terror. He is the, uh, he's al uh, with the great and terrible power. But again, if you got a problem with this, what we're saying, the fact that, you know, we, we don't, we're not about what that idiot did in, in, in New Jersey, but we are about what Yahweh Shai is about to do to you devils, you Edomites, for, for your wickedness. This is Ezekiel chapter 35 verse 10 Because thou said These two nations and these two countries Shall be mine And we shall uh, and we will possess it Whereas the Lord was there Right Therefore as I live Say Yahweh, the, Yahweh power I will even do according to thine anger And according to thy envy Which thou ha uh, hast used Out of thy hatred against them And will make myself known Among them when I have judged thee, All right? So, because of your jealousy of uh, the northern and the this southern is kingdom the nest mini from of Israel, and you can find a bit of story time magic your, uh, inside just by saying, jealousy. "Hey Google, tell and me a frozen envy story." Or actually, for us, they because will, you, you want, know, you want Elsa, your birthright back that you Anna, sold there in Square, Olaf, that you can't get back. You'd rather tell the yeah, story. Just pick you. this up and say, "Hey Google, let's read along with Using Frozen too." And Israel. you can do the reading and while it does all the cool Frozen day. story time things. Disney's the Frozen Two in theaters November twenty second. You've done to our people. And if you're a hater, you you hate my video and you talk shit. I don't care. Look what you just researched what the Edomites, the so called white man, did unto the so called Negro, Latino, Native American, the Seminole Indian, and get back out. No willingness was edifying unto the, the elect of Israel, and judgment is coming swiftly for you devils out there, man. Shalom.